What's up, Facebook? This is Walter Spake, a.k.a. Short Dog. Just want to give a big shout-out to everybody out there. Let them know that my health and strength is doing a lot, lot better, you know, through the accident I've been. You know, it's just remarkable how the grace of God has touched me, touched my body, touched my family, touched people around me, changed my life, changed a lot of people's lives around me, caused the incident, you know, not bitter in no way. You know, he sought me down because, as, as everybody knows, you know, they really know me. You know, I was doing what I wanted to do, you know, not really paying attention to no kind of law. You know, fear the law didn't, didn't even matter with me because, you know, I was doing my own thing. But God showed me that, you know, I was better than what I was doing, you know. Out there doing all kind of crazy things, different different sins, different drugs, you know, had no business, you know. A lot better than that. Now he showed me, you know. He had to show me, you know, in this way, you know, because certain things are for certain people, you know. Everybody get whooped in a different way. But he chastised those he loved. And I know he truly loved me. And a special, special shout out to my wife. And she's been a true, true soldier by being there for me. You know, and like they said, if you find a wife, you find favor with God. So if you find favor with God, it means he loves you. And I know he loves me, so you know, I know he loves all of us, but he loves some short dogs. You hear me? I, I got a little food for thought for y'all. It's been on my mind, been pondering me. You know, my, one of my favorite movies is The Passion of Christ. You know, real strong, instrumental movie. And but what really got me about the movie is in the original language, never once would did they say Jesus. You know, in the in the in the subtitles of Jesus, but as Mary was called his name was Joshua. You know, doing research on it, you know, you know, that name was his original name, you know, but we changed his name to Jesus less than five hundred years ago. So for one thousand seven hundred years after his death, it was named it was called Yahshua. You know, I know it the older Christians, don't get me wrong, they're like, you know, he has many names, you know, wonderful counselor, prince of priests, king of kings, you know, but I'm saying like this, you know, if he was here, no disrespect to no religion, no faith, because I love him, he loved me, and he allowed me to do this, so I know this is real. If he was here, what name would be on his ID? You know, it has to be the name that your mother gave. So if he was here, his name wouldn't be Jesus on his ID. It would be Yahshua or, Ye or Yeshua. Like, I have many names. Like Walter, Short Dog, Pudding, you know, but on my government, on my ID, I have to give my, my government name, the name my mother gave me, you know. So my name is Walter Spake, Walter Lee Spake Jr. on my ID. So if Christ was here, what name would be on his ID? And by, by me saying that, you know, why would we change the name that has all power? And not change a name that has no power. Okay, and for instance, like Yamin, a basketball player, and Osama bin Laden. All right, what are their English names? The same thing. We didn't change their name. So why would we change Yahshua's name to Jesus? And it said by all the powers and the miracles and everything was done in the name of Yahshua or Yeshua. But we have changed the name and became accustomed to changing the name of Jesus. Now, to the older saints again, if you just because you want to call him Yahshua or don't call him Jesus and you're still living like a devil, that don't make no difference. You know what I mean? That's meaningless. With the change of your knowledge, you're supposed to grow. You know what I mean? So this is like each one teach one. It's iron sharper iron, so the one man do another. So Yahshua was the name that Mary called him. Yahshua was the name that the angel Gabriel told him to be, to be called. So why would we have the right to change his name? And like one of my favorite songs, Kurt Franklin, shout out to Kurt. Um, there's the name of Jesus, sweetest name I know. Okay, I love that song, but do you know the name of Yeshua? Because that name was for the name of Jesus. Food for thought, love y'all, pray for me, strength and understanding, pray for my family, no disrespect, no Christian. Just want everybody to know that as we grow, we have to grow. And we have to learn different things. We can't be on tradition. Don't be afraid to read. <laughs> That's it. I love y'all. Peace.